training opportunities. Mukana kwa ba your own boss. Tiri kuti susu. Ma istola zaza sokwa ni sako famba kuse kuse. Ndi singa zivus milo. Kuti mukana waku uta training waka na kirei. Popo isusu chino ti training yedu ya kana kira kuti unodzidzi kwa kuti chi chino nzi solar. What are solar panels? Popo ku maksutra tinema qualified safety trainers. Atingo dzidzi kwa nevanu nje. Sisiti buya nini ngobune ngevenu e maksutra solar energies. Sisiti sali fundisa uguti kui ini ogutuwa i solar. Igui ini ogutuwa i li patri. What? What is a hybrid solar system? Popo anigwa zuchu obunye chichi mwe chagana kira trini nyedu and ze otu nga kwanse kuwa uze. Solar system types, off-grid, grid type, designing and sizing. And is this milo, you don't want to do it, but why you are not going to do it with your own? Isusu chino tu ya iku makusutra ni uwandi wenyu ni kuti hatisa rozi, vakazi, varume, vaskana, vakomana, ni chembere. Chino kudai mekse u makusutra, chino kuzizisai, kubaku, no tangira makezi. Ni kuti makezi edu popo ane riski. Tika terisa tambo za edu za makezi ati uone kuti izuri kufamba si chino ngona tambo nji. Saka isusu chino tu kumakusutra, lingabuya ngobune ngbinu, si alifundi, su kuti ama kezi edu avanjo anjani. Isola edu ikalela ngapi isi. Right, so uh, our program is like we are going to, we want to introduce what is solar, right? What is solar system? Uh, conversion process from the sunlight to the electrical energy, what is the process that is involved in between, right? How does that help us? That is the source or that is the starting point for design and sizing of a solar system. We have to know the resource characteristic, right? So our program is going to introduce the resource characteristics in terms of radiation physics. That's the Called, that's the title, Radiation Physics. Then we come to solar system. Solar system has got components, inverter, battery, and solar modules. Solar modules or solar photovoltaic modules. So those have got um, characteristics that have to be explored to Make sure that um, when you are choosing the battery, which battery you choose for what for what size of the system, for uh, for keeping how much energy, and for use where, in terms of temperature, in terms of a lot of things. So we are going to introduce a solar system in terms of solar modules, inverter, hybrid, uh, or grid tie, off grid. Uh, off-grid systems, grid tie systems, net metering, and so forth. Then from there, we want to move on to, uh, or we are going to move on to um, the safety, right? Or rather, before we go to safety, we are going to introduce commissioning. What is the importance of commissioning a system? When you've done everything, you've installed you have done everything. What is commissioning? What does it involve? What is the importance of commissioning? Then from there, we are going to, or we want to, uh, have our students and our candidates understand um, what is called energy audit and energy management system. Because what is involved in energy management? What is energy audit? Why do we need that? when you are dealing with solar systems and um, energy systems. Then, we are also going to introduce a very important aspect um, of everything now, which is safety. Safety. Safety involves the knowledge of power flow movement now. Power flow movement. Um, power flow, in other words, from the source to the load, power is going to move. 
And the characteristics of electrical power is electrical current is not visible. Therefore, there must be a way of, or there are fundamentals and steps to be followed for safety to be added to. And the reason being, a life lost cannot be recovered. An injury of electrical energy is mostly of high degree. One becomes disabled when electrocuted, mostly, or one got gets banned. So we want our candidates or students to understand deeply about safety. So we are going to take our students step by step, right? We do an analysis of seeing what is the level of understanding that they have, what is the level of education they ended. Then our program is structured in such that the classes are different because you can't mix a Form 3 and an Upper 6 and a university graduate, for example. So everyone can do solar, yes, but we want to, them to do it safely with knowledge that is uh, at the level. We are just going to take everyone that would have joined the program from where they ended for them to be able to be the bosses of their own. We want everyone to be a boss of their own, to do it yourself.